So yeah, so Kanye. Ah! <laughs> Ka- Capulets. Uh, that babe shit. Uh, oh, that babe shit. <laughs> <laughs> the Capulets. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> the Capulets. What? So um, it's cat sex, cap cap sex, oh. Kim the engorgement of the penis. Yeah, Kim Kardashian and uh, Kanye West. The whole reason why we d- wanted to do a He's Kanye West. So song. gonna do it. He he went there. Yeah. What? What a dick. What I miss? I miss something. What a dick. You're feeding into the media front. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Am I? You're yeah. part of the problem, Nick. Oh, all right. Well then, fuck him then. <laughs> what do I want to talk about? <laughs> fuck them. Well, now I need to no, know. No, 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 now I need. Now I need. Now I need. You brought it me out of it. You taught me out of it. I don't want to talk about you it now. You brought it up. Now you uh, have to talk, talk about, about it. it now. Yeah. Okay. Nope. I don't want to talk about it. Why you gotta be a ho- I, la 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 I la la say, la 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 I want to say, quit being such a woman, Nick. But that would be oh insensitive. Oh my god! Nick. Oh my god! You just tell now me look, what there. Nick is a very pretty lady. I, I. He is. He you, is. You, you should never talk to a pretty lady that way. Are you shining the mic stand with your snot? Yep. That's <laughs> <laughs> so gross. <laughs> that is so gross. <laughs> and that is so much more interesting than Kim Kardashian. Right? <laughs> 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 if I can, that doesn't take much. So what is it about Kim Kardashian and Kanye? She's West? bragging about how much how much spank she's making on her video game is what she's okay. doing. Okay. Hey. She, oh. Okay. Yeah. Here's the thing. What's the thing? I downloaded and played that game for about a week. Did you? Right. I did. Oh, you did? Oh, wait, oh hold on. I, what, what is, okay, give us a full review. I don't remember the exact name of the game or the application, rather, but um, is it, they say what it's called in there. Is Kim Kardashian's uh, wait? Kim Kardashian Hollywood. Uh, yeah, something like that. Okay, so it's one of the I, I forget what the what the popular term for it is, but it's one of those um, it's one of those pay to play games, you know. So it's so it's, it's a free, free. It's, it's a free download. You get right. about six minutes out of it until you go. Well, okay, I here's the thing, though. I heard about it and I read an article about it. So I was like, okay, I'm going to check this out. So I went and downloaded the app, and uh, I started playing it. But it didn't take long until I realized that, you know, you can level up a lot faster if you buy stuff. Right. Like, use, use real money that you earned right. well, to, of course. To, mean, buy, that, to buy fake stuff that right. means nothing. Well, right. that was, that was uh, Farmville's whole shtick, basically. Well, sure. And, I mean, but I know there are people who did it. I mean, it's, it's just building on an existing model. But I decided I did not want to give the Kardashians or the or the Wests a single penny out of my bank account. So right. I decided, I said, I'm going to beat this game. Hey, bestie. Oh, you downloaded it? Style. That's the video for it. Oh. Okay, so. Okay, get a you look stunning. What the fuck? It's basically. Okay, so it's basically just, just a bunch of pictures. Yeah, and, and so anyway, the I'll, I'll give you a, a brief rundown. I was like, right. I'm going to play this game and take it as far as I can without spending one single red cent. Right. How far did you get? I got okay. So you you start out right. So you're 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 like this lowly you know penniless peasant working at an upscale uh, bodega in oh, um, one of those people that we step over. When right. We're on the, our way to the uh, a, mansion. A, Isn't that like how like the Devil Wear Prada starts out? Kind of. It, uh, well. No, I don't know. I've the, never seen the movie, but I, the, I could imagine so, that that's so, how the movie so, goes. So you're some, you're some schmuck working in an in a upscale um, bodega in Beverly Hills. Right. And um, you you have a chance meeting. What the fuck is Ooh. a bodega? A chance. Uh, like a, I don't like know. A, what is a bodega? Like, like, a, bo- like boutique? a boutique? Like a boutique shop? Oh. Is that the, is that the right word? Are we I going, going clo- antiquing? How about, how about a clothing store? A clothing, a high end clothing store. Perfect. Okay. There we Fine. go. Okay, a, a high end clothing store. All right, I'm on the same. So page. you know, you're just some working schmuck, actually working to earn your money, and you know, you're like sweeping the floors. And right. Shit. Sure. Sure. No, 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 no. You're selling oh, like you're clothes. Selling. Oh, you know you what you're are, doing. You, you are, are like you are like a fashion centric kind of guy or gal, whatever you right. want to be in the in this in this game. So I'm all like, okay, I'm gonna play this game as far. And so you meet Kim Kardashian, and the idea of the game. <laughs> you ready for this? Oh, this is ought to, be good. to be Kim's friend. Oh. But in order to wow. be Kim's friend and to work your way into her circle is to... This is kind of subversive, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it is. Rise through the ranks of celebrities. So you like started like, you know, Z-list celebrity, okay? And, uh, and, and so you have to make it to the, to the top tiers of celebrity status. I think I made it so to... So you, ba- you basically friend... 
from Z list to Y list. Correct. So so like right. so like it's it's an escalating scale, and so right because now you're associated with that right Hollywood star. Correct. And then you want to climb up the ladder to the next one and the next one. And, so the, that and the idea of the game is like you know you get connected with all these different people um, through Kim because she becomes an acquaintance and you get closer and closer to her. But but so I played this game about thirty minutes a day. For about a week and a half, right. I made it to an E-list celebrity. At which point, I realized that you 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 kind of stall. You have to start buying stuff right. to um, to progress any further. At which point, I lost interest in the game and stopped playing. Right. But the thing is, is that it really is just kind of um, like the what's the word I'm looking for? Like the moral of the game is to rely is to beat down other people and rely on other people's fame or Use other people's fame for your own go- for your own Correct. purposes. Yeah. Would you like to hear what Christina the Pug thinks of the game? Sure. So Christina the Pug, why did my sound get all of a sudden really tinny and strange? Or is that just me? Is it just me? It's just you. It's just me. I don't know. My headphones might be going out. All right. So Christina the Pug. Oh God damn it! I lost. Anyway, it. Kim and I wound up being pretty close. Oh cool. Oh cool. yeah. Did so, you? Yeah yeah. I mean like you know I went to okay, her house a few times. We hung out. Okay, so Christina the Pug says, now uh, it's titled Great Game, and it's got the little emoji with the heart, sure, the sure. heart size. Aww. Okay, so that's, that's the title. She says, this game is great and all, but there are some things that really bug me. One, the most stressful and greedy thing to start with is the most beautiful, all caps, so I have to say it like that, mm-hmm. things cost so many Kim stars that it's just not fair. And that's the thing, like a Kim Star, it's kind of like, um, like in Mortal Kombat or something. Like when you like mm-hmm. take out like a really sweet combo or something, you get like the bonus points. Oh, dude, is, is there a Kim fatality? No. You can, however, like, you pull her spine out. If, like, if you have a, per- like if a you have like a particularly good photo shoot, yeah. you get some Kim Stars. Ooh, nice. mm-hmm. okay. Would yeah. you like to hear item number two? Okay. From Christi- Christina's review it says, "See, it takes so all caps again mm-hmm. long." Just to get more energy, and who wants to waste their time watching a whole ad? And that's the thing too. In order to do different activities to get Kim stars and points and stuff like yep. that, so they put a conglomerate of everything you don't want in a video game. Correct. Well, the thing is, is so after doing so many events, you actually run out of energy, and you can't go get more money or Kim stars. Right. So it makes you either pay so like you could like buy Red Bull. You can buy you can buy more energy, or you can you can put the game down for a minute and let it recharge on it, or get the energy back right. on your own. I have more reviews. So I want. think I think that's I think that's why I broke it down in the thirty minute increments because uh, that's about how long you could play before. Can you play the game not online? Have to be connected to the. No, internet. actually, you don't have to be because it's all contained in the game. Yeah, it's all. Okay. It's all here. It's all. Yeah. Okay. yeah. So okay, so three Weberg, W E B E R G says. Well, as much as I like this game, you are sometimes forced to buy B Y E. By the way, th- buy. buy things to buy things. <laughs> <laughs> buy. <laughs> buy a <Felicia. laughs> Where the Most fuck did that come from? What the, the fuck, dude? You did don't know you? where that came from? Friday, dude. Movie Friday? Next Friday or just Friday? No, just Friday. It smells like rotten eggs, dude. Tucker, yeah. This is you, Nick. <laughs> yes, this is all you. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> the avocados have evolved. Bye, Felicia. Uh, you don't remember that scene? Uh, Chris Tucker and uh, I think it's Chris Tucker and uh, Ice so Cube are sitting for on For like a hundred years that movie's been out. Yeah. And, and just, just now, now. That's become a thing. Bye, Felicia. Bye, yep. Felicia. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What the fuck? This world is fucked. Yeah. I don't even want to read that review anymore. Why? I don't know. Just don't. No. I didn't get enough Kim stars to read so, it. Oh. Okay, here's, okay, so here's the question, Nick. Are you going to give it a shot? I should. You should do it. You really know, should. all right, I will do that. I will do this for the show. Well, I am ooh. downloading Kim Kardashian's Hollywood. I will play it until we do the next podcast. And install. Oh, wow. I Nick can't, can't play it for like a week. I don't know. Yeah. The thing is, it's weirdly oh addictive. Well, it really course, is. Well, of course you they hate, are. You hate to say that it was kind of okay. Right. That's we what I mean. Like, I, I hate long saying I it, but it. it's true. Right. We will see how long I can stomach it and see how far I get in this. Now, okay, are you going to spend money? Oh, God, no. Okay. No. Yeah. Well, you're going to I think, I think my, my interest would have been prolonged in it had I spent money, but 
Because you feel like you needed a return on. Your well, life. because you've you've invested in it, and therefore you're going to like make the best of it. If I didn't right. drop a single cent in there, I'm like, screw this, I'm done. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Right. Yeah. <laughs> it was very rare that I ever put money into a game. Right. I'd rather just pay four ninety nine. Like Actually, off the Nick, bat. I think you should document it because you, sh- you have to create a character and stuff for yourself. So okay. I think I think you should okay. like take screenshots and stuff. Okay, I will I will do my best to document this as well as I can. If God help me, if my kids or if my wife searches through my photo history, <laughs> it doesn't uh. matter. But here's the thing, though. I think because. I'm I'm a very casual game player. Like I, you look I'll like you're about to stab yourself with that freaking corkscrew. By the way, one of you motherfuckers. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I I'm a very casual game player. I'm not big into video games. The games I play are actually on the phone, and then when I do, I don't play for that long, really. Right. right. And I'll go through games pretty quickly. I'm curious, Nick. You are an actual gamer. I am a hardcore you gamer. You are an correct. actual gamer. I'd be curious to see what you have to say. Yeah, it's going to be. I'm community. currently playing The Division, which is a big, you know, Tom Clancy freaking modern military thing. Right. Now I'm going to be playing Kim Kardashian Goes to Hollywood or whatever the It's all this. I mean, I has think, a, how many games do you play on your phone? Like my it, phone? It, it, does a phone? Uh, does a phone? Based game cons- is that considered gaming? Yes, absolutely. It is. Here, here's my here's my my thoughts on that. It is considered gaming. However, a hardcore gamer like myself, in my opinion, uh, I have a hard time finding games that I can really sink my teeth into. I it, it is, it's is happened. It, is it it's because happened. you're a first person shooter kind of guy? No, it's just because there's a certain amount of. Um, I got a game to recommend for you then, if you're interested. Once we're off air. Okay, there is. I'll put it this way. There oh, is, uh, it's that good that it has to be off air. Well, it's hard to explain, but yeah. Well, like some some games, for Does example, it? for like like okay, uh, like puzzlers, for example. Like if you're into puzzle games, there are a games. lot of fantastic choices. And Fort Defense. Yeah, because Ooh, uh, Fort Defense like, is good. I like mm-hmm. that. One. There, there, there are some pretty good. They call it Tower Defense. Tower, Tower Defense. Sorry. Oh, yes. dude, but that was Rampart back in, mm-hmm. in Nintendo days, which was like that my was favorite Rampart. favorite game ever. Mm-hmm. Yes. Really was. I was I loved it. Yes. So. And unfortunately, the one on the phone is a little too easy. There's dude. There's a ton of Tower Defense games on the phone. Seriously, there are. I, I need so to get many. into it. There are so many. Plants I found a lot of them were too easy. easy. Plants vs Zombies. That yeah. was probably the, Plants vs Zombies was probably the first game that I actually picked up on a phone and played obsessively. Yeah. And, like, and mm-hmm. I, I did that as opposed to playing on other systems. And right. Other right. Things. I picked up and I played the ever living hell out of that. Uh-huh. Man. Uh, but are you considered a pussy in the gaming world? Oh no, uh, no, that's not a real game. No. Yeah, well, I, well, hold on. There is a, there is a bit of a stigma, and and to well, extent, gamers tend to be pretty violent about things anyway. So but there's, there's going to be the ones that also annoying, not, annoyingly so. Sometimes. Is there YouTube channels devoted to watching people play? At base, I can't say I've ever searched it out, but I would imagine it probably exists. Okay. Yeah, I, I but I I'm a huge gamer. Like I said, I don't get too many. I actually I just played a couple that were fantastic. I'll even recommend them. Really? Uh, there's a game called Lifeline. You can search out. It's a very simple game. It's, it's all text, by the way. It's all text-based. And the premise of the game nice. is there's somebody call, th- somebody gets stranded on, uh, on, a, on an alien planet. They get stranded. And for whatever reason, you're the only person uh, that, that they so can talk like to. So it's like the Martian kind of thing. It's sort of like that. But mm-hmm. it, he, he basically tells you, hey, this is my situation. What should I do next? That's kind of cool. And the cool is thing that is, free, is that a free game or no? Uh, no, uh, I got it because it was it was free, and I'm actually I'm about to buy the other two because there's like three of them. Uh, but it was fun. it was fantastic. The writing is amazing. Really, Excellent. and it you basically just and the guy can die by the way. Like my, my first play. Oh no, this is like the Gigapets. Oh, oh <laughs> yeah, like, oh he died. My guy, my guy died in a horrible way too. But it, it was really really good. But games like that, can you um, restart after you kill the guy. Yeah, you can. Okay, oh, yeah, you can okay, restart okay, from okay. all. Our, See, yeah. here's my thing with with the phone games, though, is that a lot of the phone games that I play. I can't I'm believe on, we're having a gamer when, discussion. By the way, this is making I'm, me so happy. When I'm on the phone, I can never have this so discussion I, on the show. I play incessantly at the airport. When okay. I'm when I'm on flights, incessantly. The yeah. problem is when you board the plane and you go to start up the game, it goes, "Well, you don't have an internet connection." And I'm yeah. like, what does that have to do with anything? That's why you need. That's why. Uh, look, a lot of the puzzle, puzzler games, like for example, Circix, which for some reason doesn't work on my 6s plus. I even emailed uh, the uh, the makers because I, I I didn't make the game. I just did the music for it. But I, but for whatever reason, oh, Circix, you just plugged yourself. Did you? Sure did. <laughs> I tried to, I tried oh, to sneak looks that like in. they fixed it. Nope, it, it's, it's broken. It crashes. Um, on the big phones, I don't. I think they didn't. It's probably the, a graphic. It's thing. They the didn't graphic the rest, thing, It's yeah. probably that. Yeah, but it it, it doesn't work. But it, that's it's. I'm yes, I'm shilling my shit, but it's good. It's a fun little game to play. It is. I, I've played it actually. It's very good. Yeah, there's uh, Monument Valley. Monument Valley is fantastic. Um, it got it got famous because that's actually one of the games that Kevin Spacey is playing on House of Cards. 
Oh, really? Oh. Yeah, that's, that is also How much did really they pay good. him? I Jeez. guarantee they probably paid a few oh, dollars absolutely. for that. But it's a really good game. It's 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 really really fantastic. Right. But I think you're limited by the touch controllers. Like playing an actual, I've tried playing the shooters on on, on the phone, and in my opinion, it's not satisfying at all. Why? Some people like. I it. can't do it. The interface just doesn't work. I oh. tried playing Mortal Kombat on the phone. That doesn't work either. Wait. Yeah, I, well, here's my thought process though. But is that just a challenge that you need to overcome, or it it, it relates it was, to me in multiple levels of my life? If it was fun, yes, but. Because the interface is so cumbersome, in my opinion, it's not it's not worth the effort of trying to get over it. Like, but I, I are lose you just very quickly? Not to be not to be mean, but is that just because you're lazy about it? Don't mm-hmm. feel like lazy. understanding the new interface. Eh, po- possible, you know, like possible. But I, but at the same time, if 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 my opinion did not resonate with the other hardcore gamers, you would see more games like that. If you never had a game that had an actual controller. It yeah. probably would be a good game. If you never touch the controller, you probably would, you know. Well, like I said, the, the game that I just recommended, Lifeline, that's literally you just pick a choice. It just gives you two choices, and right. it's kind of two your own But that's brilliant. I mean, that's all it is. Yeah, and I understand. Yeah. You can play that anywhere. Right. I mean, that, but the brilliant thing, but I, I would honestly recommend, even if, if you could play it on PC, I would still stay playing on your phone because the guy sends you messages, and it's and if you enable notifications, it's like you're getting a text message from the guy, and it kind of adds to the... Oh, gosh. You know, like, in my in my opinion, it's a very well-designed game because it feels like... Kind of reminds you of Martian. Mm -hmm. That was a pretty good movie. Yeah, he said that five minutes ago. I said that. Yeah. Yeah. He said, ooh. Reminds him of the Martian. Yeah. So, okay, (laughs) fine. Since we're talking about it, I'll go ahead and plug the game I was telling you about. It's called Framed. Okay. And this one appeals to me because it's a comic book. But it's like it's like old, you know, noir, like like noir style or whatever. All right. And it gives you a screen full of panels, and you have to arrange them in a way to help your person escape because he's been framed. Oh. It's actually a really really cool game. That's so it's like who framed neat. Roger Rabbit? Kind of, yeah, yeah. But but yeah, and and so but if you if you arrange the if you arrange the frames wrong, it'll show the fate of your character because usually he falls off a cliff or gets shot by a cop or something. So yeah, it's, yeah. it's pretty cool. Wow, get shot by a cop. Mm-hmm. Nice. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but I, I, I guess I highly recommend Lifeline. But I, I'm definitely gonna, I'll, I'll try Framed. And uh, oh, you tried? For I'll try. I will oh, try. Uh, I, haven't, try. I haven't tried it yet, but I, I will try. I, w- I want you to try Frame because it's a good game, but I also I really want to hear about your I'm opinion and experience with the Kim Kardashian. I'm going to right. fully that's, document that's my huge. Kim Kardashian uh, because, and I say that because you are in fact an actual gamer. Yes, right. I'm yeah. a very hardcore gamer. So, and that's kind of one of those things where you want to like crack the, the the. I don't understand the mind of the gamer because I was never in the games. But do you watch TV? No, not really. You know why I don't watch TV? Ha ha ha. Is because the TV in my bedroom is a regular TV that's plugged into the wall, and I'm too lazy to go to Cox to get the little adapter <laughs> that you got to pay four dollars a fucking month for. So every time you turn on my TV, you know what it says? Hey, well, you need to buy this adapter in order to. Fuck is it the analog to digital or digital yeah? Analog, whatever. But you can't yeah. buy it; you have to rent it. Oh, you can go buy one of those, dude. No, you, not for with Cox. Not with Cox. Not with Cox. Well, no, well Cox st- stinks. But you can still get an HD receiver. You're fine. I have one. I have ten channels. Hey, I'm go. paying for 190. Oh uh, well. You know what I'm saying? Like they're literally forcing you to buy to rent this little converter. Yeah. Bullshit, oh, dude. It's bullshit. And you know, say, I'm paying for all this cable, and all I need to do is spend an extra four dollars a month, oh, <laughs> and yes, I can so actually people. watch I it. Know, I know. I, I was about to point that out. Thank you. <laughs> you know what but, I'm uh, saying? Because you're like, I cut the cable, dude. Dude, I haven't had cable in a year and a half, and I absolutely love it. Wait. Okay. So I don't I, have any cable. So let me ask you this. Yeah. What do you watch on TV? Uh, not a lot. I, I'm not a big TV watcher. Uh, w- when I do watch TV, it's uh, for example, if I, um, I am a Saints fan, I follow the NFL. Uh, I can get that with an antenna. I have a digital antenna, so okay, all right. I can't DVR them. So if I so if I'm out of the house, well, I miss it, and I'll just have to catch highlights online, which right. sucks, but whatever. Okay, but that's that's football games. Okay, cool. That's football games. So I I will watch the NFL games on TV. Right. Um. What else do I watch? Uh, uh Netflix. I watch Netflix. Mm-hmm. I watch a lot of Netflix. But what like shows? So okay. What shows do I watch? Are you asking me? It, yeah. Um, let's see. Like How, what, uh, well, well, we, we just said House of Cards. Mm-hmm. Um, 
That's not even. That's weird because I normally don't like that sort of drama about House of Cards. But House of Cards. But the only reason you know House of Cards, you know really Cards is through Netflix is through. But Netflix. it's the that's the only way you can watch it. Is mm-hmm. it's a Netflix original. Yeah. Um. My favorite show before they canned it was Top Gear. I watched that show a lot. Now, how did you watch the British that? version, not the American version? Uh, that one, uh, they have they have a bunch of episodes online Netflix. Right. So when a new episode comes out, it would well you, you, don't you have to you be patient. Yeah. Yeah. It, it's you know the, the only um uh yes, the only the only shows that that I would say I actively try to stay really current on is like Game of Thrones when that comes out like I I I, I get HBO now and I watch it. And you know, I'll watch it that night, and the servers can handle it, so it right. hasn't been a problem yet. But that's because you have somebody else's login. No, I have my own. I, I pay for it. Oh, you can pay for the HBO. HBO, go? you can get as a separate wow. account, I just like Netflix. That. Yeah. No way. Welcome to the year 2016, sir. Fucking hey, they finally like fixed that. Yeah. Bullshit. Well, my question: are you, are you a cable person or? Uh, only for the child. Only for the child. Mm-hmm. You can get around it now. Now, for me, with mm-hmm. the child. Is I'm completely opposite. He doesn't watch a goddamn thing on cable. Well, he watches everything on Netflix, Amazon Prime. Like he has his shows. It's Nick Jr. They do have some my good kids, stuff. On my that. kids were Nick Jr. and there was a little bit of a transition phase, but mm. once they made it, like it wasn't a problem. Exactly. And I would like to bring up something new that has has just been turned on to me is the uh, is the Fire Stick hack. I'm not familiar. I don't have a Fire Stick. So yeah, you get the Fire Stick. It's Amazon Fire Stick, I think. Yes. So what you do is is you get somebody to mod it, and it basically opens up the entire world of video for free. Yeah, because you, you oh yeah, because you can install XBMC and Cody. The, the two, Co- uh, yeah, Cody is like the yeah. shit. I think the it's shit. I think it's also uh, it might be a little illegal. It's not. Some of it, if you're getting stuff for free, uh, which, uh, if you're getting stuff for free, it's illegal. See, uh, well, you Cody got, itself may not be illegal, you want, but if you're getting yeah, stuff Yeah, Cody's free, not illegal. Yeah. So you can watch any movie that just came out in theaters. You can yeah. watch any episode of anything. Yeah, that, yeah that, exactly. That's, that's it's, illegal. It's that's, illegal. Yeah, that's that's illegal. It's illegal. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I mean, I actually do care. Cause I, think I do. That, like, yeah, I, I think I've is, found I think myself caring ethical. a lot more about that lately. I mean, how much crap do I watch on YouTube? A lot of stuff. I watch way more. You I, I watch, watch movies, movies on YouTube. And that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I like, watch dude, movies all the time. I'm YouTube. telling you, dude. The day that I cut the cord, and I do, I, I, I didn't have um, Cox. I had Cox before, and I, I was thankful to get rid of them. I liked you well, versus just fine. Well, but once you get out of that, right? It's easy because so I was a huge MythBusters fan. Yep, that was like my shit. Yes, you know. And then once I watched I, a little bit of that, and then once I cut the cord. I really could no longer watch Mythbusters. I can Myth always Busters tell how entertaining episodes. the conversation is when Ben starts playing. Yeah. <laughs> well, Does that mean it's time to wrap up? Here's my process. So, Mythbusters was on for like fucking ten seasons. They just wrapped. I can't fucking watch a goddamn. Be- I can't find episodes for free. The really, the really popular shows. They like made it fucking impossible. You got to jump through a lot of hoops to get. It's just yeah. like for example, like Game of Thrones. Unless you're willing to just straight up pirate it, you got to go through HBO. You're not right. going to find anywhere. Star Wars movies, you're not streaming that shit. You Co- got to buy the DVDs. Cody, right there. Well, yeah, Cody's exactly, got but it's illegal. You. But it's illegal. Any They're other, not, any kind of, well, yeah, well, streaming anything is illegal if it's copyrighted material. Yeah. So anyway, technically, all right. it's the sound in it, but whatever. All right. I, see, I, like, know, I like their fixes for that. I'm like, reading Kardashian reviews. Yeah. Uh, do you want to read one? And get us out of this. No. no. Do you, do you, wanna, do you, I, you started doing what I was doing earlier, dude. I was flipping through them, and I was like, "Oh, this is this is <laughs> this is beyond amusing." I, I I could read those reviews. They amuse me. I don't know if they amuse anybody else, but no, I I, I, I love reading uh, app reviews. Yeah. So. Because I tried to watch the MythBusters finale, and you only get like a minute, and you're like, "Now I really want to well, watch yeah, they, it." Well, yeah, they tease you with it. Where the fuck can you find it? Other than iTunes Discovery. to buy it. You have to go to Discovery. But Discovery doesn't have all the episodes. If they don't have, well, then you'd have to buy it from iTunes or some right. other source. It's like a thing. We should wrap up because we're definitely tired. We've all been drinking. Yeah, now a lot I want to watch fucking Mythbusters. You all are fucking assholes. Well, there you go. You can go home and watch your Mythbusters. How? All I right. can't. You'll figure it out, I'm sure. All right, Chris. We'll, I got to we'll, go we'll, get Cody. What do you want to plug? Uh, my butt. <laughs> Your butt. I'm, I'm Your butt. Right. Yeah. Next we butt. have been doing Woo! this show for around six or seven years. It has taken that long for that joke to surface. I meant to say your butt. <sighs> I 
I meant to say it because your butt needs to be plugged. I have no response. Shout out to Nick's farts. <laughs> They've been shouting out at us all night, man. I've been How shouting about? at you. Uh, audio Entertainment. Uh, you got any gigs coming up? Uh, hey, you want to plug? Well, I'm sure you do. That's, but a, that's a crazy question. That you want to plug? <laughs> since that's my job. You doing any uh, doing any bands? I you were Dr. John one weekend. That was pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, I did uh, Dr. John recently. I did uh, Aaron Carter, uh, yeah. Nick Carter's brother from uh, InSync. Uh, anything good I got coming? I got the Tennessee Williams. Uh, festival. festival, yeah, that, you're gonna be at the huge. Tennessee Williams Festival. That's a big that's thing huge. here in New Orleans. Are you running the audio? Are you running the audio over there at uh, Le Petit or? No, the the venue is actually at the Jackson on the River. Oh, really? Okay, they moved yeah, it. They moved it. Uh, well, it it got. They didn't think it was gonna be a thing, right? It, so, and but it thing. turned it turned out to be like okay, yeah, it's a it thing. Is, it is like huge. Okay. Huge, so I've got that coming up. I mean, you know, just other uh, other bands. Shout out to all the bands that I ran sound for this past weekend. Phenomenal weekend. All right, any of them you care to name or Paper Chasers? Uh, they did fan fucking tastic. Uh, Southern Brutality. Uh, those guys were fucking amazing. Um, and then we also had uh, other bands, of certain names. Uh, fuck. My brain hurts when it comes to band names. Bands of certain names. That's a. That's actually a pretty good band names. name. That's a. <laughs> yeah. So right. like I, I there, I can't even like pop it up. It's, but really good bands. Phenomenal weekend. Indeed, they've been. Yeah. What would you like to plug? What? <laughs> wait, wait. Can I? Can I plug Ben? For <laughs> ben? Plug Ben. Go ahead. I think I've heard the plugs. Oh wait. oh, wait. Okay, go ahead. Chris wants to plug Ben. I'm oh, going to plug Ben. I'm oh, going to no. do, do a dramatical <laughs> dramatical reading of Ben <laughs> plugging himself. Dramatical. <sighs> yeah. Well, I got pickles and hot sauce, so you can go uh, plug that. Uh, you know, we're going to plug that again. And we're going to plug it again. You can check my comic strips out. Uh, hit me up on Twitter. Uh, I don't even What's know this what What's this Twitter? Oh, you ben, fail. Ben. Oh, oh you wait, fail. Wait, did I fail my own test? I think you failed. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Shit. No, Ben just did a... Uh, in fact, I haven't seen it yet. You know what? We're going to pull it up. <gasps> what am I forgetting I from Ben's usual plugs? Uh, please, please fuse my face to you so we can go inseminate eggs together. Nice. There we go. I forgot. Ben just recently redid his website. There I go. noticed that. Mm-hmm. Look at that. This is the sad part is, is I actually look at your website. Pickles mm-hmm. and hot sauce. It's crazy. It's a good mm-hmm. website. It actually is. Thank you. I'll, I'll like, I like click on it once every couple months yeah. when yeah. it like kind of has the newer content. Well, there you go. There's the there new go. look. I dig it. I dig it. It looks good. It looks good. Mm-hmm. Let's click on more stuff. Let's click on stuff. Oh, look. It's a public record of comics. <laughs> <laughs> I like public <laughs> records. God, you've done that many? Yeah. Jeez, man. Holy crap. Your resume is uh, banging. Yeah. You must be a funny guy. Got my Facebooks, my Twitters up there. Oh, I didn't do your Facebook. Go That's say hi. Me. Check me out. Yeah, picklesandhotsauce.com. Pickles and sauce with underscores in between mm-hmm, on Twitter. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Or you can even go to brainstatic.net, and uh, it's actually embedded. Uh, uh, both my feed and Ben's feed are, yeah. are directly embedded. Right and, there on the front and page. I was I was for the most part abstaining from the from the social medias of my uh, my comic there for a while because you know if I'm not working on the comic I'm not gonna have fun damn it I'm not gonna have but fun. You really do enjoy that though. I do enjoy. I mean, it, but yeah. you, your work is actually I like your comic. Oh, thank you. Yeah. yeah, Ben and I have a lot of fun on Twitter. The show doesn't stop just because we're not on the air. <laughs> right. This is all. This is. I, I almost wish we could share text messages and Facebook messages. Every, that we send every each other once in a while, I chime in on you guys on the Twitter. Mm-hmm. And once like in a while. Once in a while. Yeah, it's, it's all there. And like that's actually me right. I yeah, I retweeted Ben. Look at that. Oh, there we go. I'm yeah, looking yeah. out for my buddy. So there you go. Figures on hotsauce.com. Me. Go read some comics. Yep. Uh, I am twitter.com slash vexin. Uh, V-E-X-X-I-N. I don't really have anything else I've to plug, I've never actually plugged my Twitter. <laughs> That's because you're never on it. You never, you never use it. I get, like, these notifications and stuff, and I'm like, what? What happened? What is this and magical place be, called the internet? Nick's got to be like, hey, check your Twitter. And they're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I, wasn't, you know, I was like, oh. Oh, hey, hey. Yeah, I was mentioned. Hey, oh, it cool, worked. Good for me. 
All right. I think that's it for tonight. Unfortunately, uh, we, we don't have any – we didn't do any intro. Mo- I kind of liked it, though. You know what? I kind of like the no intro, no outro yeah. music. Just turn on, talk, and well, – it, it, well, was, it was in our moment of that's, technical that's difficulties. vintage right there. Yeah. Thank you for being patient with us through all the technical difficulties. We are working on it. i got to spend some money, which means i got to make some money because I don't have uh, any. Uh, maybe you should go talk to uh, Kim. Uh, I'll break your back for I you. i got to go talk to Kim. Go yeah. talk to Kim. You know, get get some help developing an app. Yes. And, uh, I will report back. People with my Kim people Kardashian will pay adventures. money to be Dude, your fake friend. Could, could we do? Awesome. Could we do a a total BS podcast app? Sure, we or could. people have to jump th- through f- flaming hoops to become our friends. How many condoms did you have to taste to get to get <laughs> total oh BS coins? Uh, At the know? very end, you'll get you get Brussels sprouts. How much yeah, humiliation <laughs> can you <laughs> understand? <laughs> right? <laughs> can you withstand? And the game makes absolutely no sense at all. <laughs> But perfect sense at the same time. <laughs> All righty. I think, I think that's it. Is that it? I think that's, that's it. That's it. it. Yep. Good, night. Good night, everybody. See you. Good night.